today we've got a first for Bristol, um, a first for John Lewis and a first for St Peter's Hospice. Um, it is a St Peter's Hospice charity boutique pop-up shop in John Lewis here at the Mall. The idea for the new pop-up charity shop in Cribs Causeway came about last year through an open discussion about the future of Bristol's High Street. There was a little bit of discussion about charity shops being almost the scourge of the High Street and um, I uh, asked a question and said that I thought that the, that the standard High Street retail should work together with charity shops and how could they work together. Very luckily, Shelley Sturdy from John Lewis, the brand manager from John Lewis, was on the panel and she said, well, why don't you have a pop-up? So obviously I uh, almost rugby tackled her and said yes, <laughs> how can we make that happen? And that was nine months ago and since then we've got a great partnership with them, we've got the shop for 16 days um, and we are also doing, we had a year of the nurse event so they're bringing in, doing fundraising for us. So yeah, that's what's happening today, our first pop-up shop. In a time when people are talking about sustainability and as a department store we're reinventing our shops to be um, fit for the future, it felt absolutely right to have a pop-up shop of St Peter's Hospice that touches so many people's lives um, in our shop. And what we hope is that this will be a real success and will lead us into what else we can do in the future. We want it to have the proper, proper brands in here that people who shop in John Lewis are going to come in and discover and then they realise that charity shopping isn't what maybe might, they might have thought and come to our other 51 shops here in Bristol. The brand new pop-up shop even gave employees the opportunity to try a new way of shopping. I've never bought anything in a charity shop and today I've picked up this item. So my daughter's 14 and she would look utterly fabulous in this Reese skirt for £10. We're going to a wedding in the summer. So I think it is also encouraging a new customer to shopping um, within the vintage charity market. Who knows where this will go?